Good morning. Today is Friday, September 24th, 2021, Spirit Day. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Our Lucio Middle School mission statement. Lucio Middle School teachers unite with passion to produce quality instruction and empower tomorrow's leaders. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. You may be seated. Our lines for this week in the sixth grade, Italia Espinosa and Sergio De La Fuente. In the seventh grade, Jasmine Guterres and Armando Cruz. In the eighth grade, Sonia Garcia and Juan Lastra. Congratulations to our lines for this week. We hope that you had an outstanding week. Our lines of the week for next week in the sixth grade is Haley Slovak and John Campos. In the seventh grade for next week, Estrella Moreno and Anthony Matambu. And in the eighth grade for next week, Cassandra Alanis and Eliazar Erugas. Congratulations to our Lions for next week. Feel free to dress down the whole entire week. That way we can easily identify you. Just make sure you have your pass on you at all times. Our word of the week is boycott, meaning withdraw from commercial or social relations with a country, organization, or person as a punishment for protest. Announcements. The Battle of the Books first practice starts next week on Thursday, September 30th, right after school. See you there. The end of the first six weeks is today. So let's see how our students are coming along with closing the gaps. Remember, it's very important that we continue to grow academically this whole entire year. America's Choice Fundraiser is on and the race has begun. This fundraiser will be rewarding students raising money for that, raising money to provide surprise treats, to provide prizes to students who are growing academically, pizza and ice cream parties throughout the year, funds and order forms are due Thursday, October 7th. We already hear that students want to turn in now. No, we are not turning them in now. We are waiting until October 7th. You need to collect the money and the forms. If you need more forms, come on down to front office and we will give you some. We've already had a handful of students request additional forms. So outstanding. Ooh. The top seller competition, this is what's going to happen. Our first place will receive a $60 gift certificate. Second place will be $40 and third place will be $25. Plus, there's all the other things that the America's Choice Fundraiser is also doing that you heard about. Now, I'm going to elaborate. It's not necessarily a gift certificate. Basically, what happens, for example, is we'll show you, for example, Walmart. And you can choose anything you want up to $60 and we will order it for you. So that's pretty much what the gift certificate is. And there will be other merchants you can choose from. Bottom line, free stuff is free stuff. So thank you. And we look forward to seeing who our top sellers will be. Also, we're going to have a homeroom competition. The homeroom in the sixth grade, in the seventh, in the eighth grade, each one have an opportunity, all homerooms, to win a pizza party for that homeroom. Uh, it's going to be based on the sales, not the items, the sales, the amount of money that you bring in. Also, we are going to set a minimum standard. For example, if there's not a minimum that is met, then no one wins um, that homeroom competition. There must be a minimum sell. We will get you that information very soon, but hopefully we don't have to resort to the minimum standard. We've never had to in the past, so let's not make this year any different. Then we have a grade level competition. The grade level with the highest amount of sales will have an ice cream party during lunch, and that's for the grade level. And no, we're not going to have a first, second, and third place. If you need to see the presentation, it is available on our Lucio Middle School YouTube, so feel free to look that up. Uh, remember to sell responsibly. Collect the money responsibly, turn them in, and be safe responsibly. Okay, the next free dress pass for the new wristband holders is today, Friday. Thank you very much for your donation. Students with this 
wristband, specialized color for today, are permitted to wear whatever they want. And um, you must have your wristband on display. Everyone else, make sure that you are following the uniform. Today is Spirit Day, so Spirit shirts for Lucio or Lopez is the only thing that you may wear. The school orders for the shirts have come in, so make sure your parents grant you permission if you want to pick those up. And like we said, we've already started addressing students who are not in uniform. Now, every single person must be in uniform. There is no more white polo shirts allowed, no more t-shirts allowed, unless if it's a college day, that's a college t-shirt or a, a spirit day on Friday shirt. You must be in the appropriate uniform. Reminders about social distancing. It is your responsibility. After school detention will resume next week on Monday. Students who are gathered up in tardy roundups will have detention that same day. And anybody else who's coming in late to school if once we see that there's a pattern, you will have after school detention and you will be notified for that. Students, if you have detention, it is your responsibility to self-report. If you do not report, you will have another day and you will have a referral. Remember what happens when you get the three referrals. And if you don't know, good. Keep it that way. Happy birthday to the following students. Melissa Huerta, David Medina, Lisa Suarez, Adrian Vela, Kevin Martinez, Eduardo Reese, and Kayla Garcia. Happy birthday to all of you celebrating birthdays today and this weekend. Lastly, in closing, our Lucio Lions are respectful students. They're responsible students who care for themselves and each other. They are fair students, honest students, trustworthy students, and outstanding Lucio Middle School citizens. Have a fantastic Friday and a wonderful weekend. We'll see you around campus.